Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and this video is sponsored by Frontier. I will be competing against RT Game to try and make the worst planet coaster that I possibly can. The winner is going to be decided by Frontier and uh, we'll also get a few goodies to give away including a game codes and a special giveaway box so I'm hoping I can do you proud. The console edition of the game just came out and if you want to buy it for yourself there is a link in the description to check that out. I got it for the PS4 so let's uh, jump in and see what it's like shall we? All right let's get started. Ow! Wait you can build in a city now? Yes! <laughs> I want to destroy this city! <laughs> All the land value is gonna plummet. There we go, city park. That's not- Oh, I made a little typo. Ah, let's just ignore it. That's fine. Ah, my first guest. <laughs> She's probably just confused what's going on here. She came on a walk out of the city and there's just this vast empty space waiting to be ruined. Look at that. They just turn around as soon as they realize there's no more path. The damn city slickers. And look at that. The rude two just bumping into each other like that. I'm making the path first and then we'll fill in the gaps later. <laughs> That's my plan anyway. <laughs> okay, I've made a really long path now. I think I'm good. <laughs> Okay, so I think at the very end of the path should be the bathrooms, of course. Oh, wait, smoothies. Yes, we're gonna sell loads of smoothies at the entrance and then the bathrooms are gonna be way over there. Go Did they just say go pee? Oh, coffee. Perfect. <laughs> okay, everything here at the entrance. These are all drinks. Stupid city slickers. And even if they don't buy any of the smoothies, if they're out this far from the city, there's not gonna be another bathroom for miles. And city slickers won't use a bush. They look down on me for that. They look down on people for that. Close one. Western toilets, perfect. There we go, right at the end of the path. You can't even see the entrance from here. Ah, words to live by at the moment. Do your business, wash your hands. Oh, people are coming in, great. Buy something. Yes, go for the coffee, good choice. Okay, what was that? Did he just realize, oh no, I actually, I, I cannot remember how to socially interact with people after this whole lockdown business. He's just 180 and now he's running away. He's fleeing from the park. I don't have any staff rooms. You know what? They can go over there with the toilets too. <laughs> the poor staff members. I forgot I even had staff. I forgot, you know, people have to work at those things and it's just, it's not just machines. I just found the most depressing thing ever. A melted snowman. Now, hold on, I'll, I'll be right back. I gotta put this by the entrance. Look at how depressing that is. I think I need a sign as well just saying, remember kids, death is coming. <laughs> you, just like this snowman, have an expiration date. <laughs> All right, there we go. The entrance is littered with the Death of happiness. Now I'll do the staff building. <laughs> Which is, you know, also the death of happiness if you're working in a place like this. All right, the staff building can be a fortress. They might need to retreat here in case the parkourers start to rebel. I have no idea what the theme of this place is. So far, it's just depression. <laughs> like I have a fort for a staff building, a western saloon for a toilet, and the fucking smoothie places are just all over the place. I don't know what is going on. Oh, someone needs the bathroom, I think. They're <laughs> just running off. Oh, the poor person. <laughs> what about some special effects? That might be cool. I think it's good to start with the psychological torture before I actually start building the torture devices, <laughs> which are also known as coasters. Right, there we go. Well, this will definitely trigger some non flashbacks. All right, I have enough fireworks to send even the most hardened human into just a full on panic attack. <laughs> there is so many all over the entrance, not to mention the city is gonna regret granting me permission to build a theme park here. They probably pictured more of a Disneyland rather than, you know, an insurance claim waiting to happen. All right, you know what this theme park needs? And this may shock you, but some roller coaster rides. Or it might be good to put down some ATMs just because, you know, people will need to buy coffee and smoothies and stuff, so put some down there. What is this archer? <laughs> all right, in order to access the park, you gotta dodge all these arrows. <laughs> I'm never gonna place rides at this point. I keep getting distracted. We could also use it some staff members. I think I'm just gonna put in a load of mascots. <laughs> Again, just psychological trauma. <laughs> oh my god, they're awful. I like to think that every mascot is just a visitor of the park who went insane <laughs> and never got to leave again. Oh my god. <laughs> this is terrifying in itself. Who needs rides? I think my park is gonna specialize in psychological horror. <laughs> this poor family is gonna suffocate. <laughs> Cause of death. <laughs> Smothered by 
Many people in cow suits on bouncing balls. 15th one this week. <laughs> oh, I was gonna put some out in the grass and have some free range ones, but you're not allowed actually, funnily enough. So if you guys want to go to the bathroom, bear in mind it is very far away and you'll have to use those bouncing balls on about 700 flights of stairs. <laughs> All right, it's looking like people can't even access the park right now, so I better, <laughs> I better stop. That family is lost, by the way. All right, let's leave them to it and let's leave them roam around <laughs> a little bit. Well, I put in some uh, rides. I'm gonna put in just normal rides. I just want to attract people in here. What's the most extreme ride we got here? Impulse. Yeah, <laughs> build that. Oh my god, it's massive. Good thing I have a load of room. <laughs> this is just gonna piss off the city even more. You know, we'll get rid of that. It's actually way too big. Chaos theory. Now that sounds good to me. <laughs> oh my god, it is huge. I don't know if I can even fit this in my park. Well, it doesn't help, you know, the way I built the park. Oh wait, sweet spot. Oh my god, that is awful. It's going right through the park and around this stairway. Oh, how did that actually work? Chaos Theory has not been tested. I think Chaos Theory would be a good name for the park, to be honest with you. Alright, let's get Chaos Theory back to the uh, pathway here. There we go. It's always nice to have the entrance mixed up with the exit, so all the people leaving the ride have to go past the people queuing for the ride. Grand Carousel. That's a good song to have on this ride, I think. Oh wait, I can create a Trigger, so when they go over it, that'll trigger all the fireworks over here for some reason, just so it's constantly going off. Oh my god, it's gonna be so obnoxious. <laughs> inspection? Why would we need an inspection? Never. Build it right and you build it once. <laughs> oh, the trigger's working. Fantastic. How are these triggers working? Quite well, by the looks of it. The people are overwhelmed. Get money for the ATM or we'll never let you go. <laughs> I mean, moo. <laughs> that one guy's enjoying it, but the rest of them are all like, move. <laughs> Got loads of cow puns, honestly. I'm gonna milk this thing as much as I can. <laughs> I think this one's got the furthest. They're going on a bit of a mission. I think they're kind of tired now, though. <laughs> they got pretty far. Did anyone go up the stairs? No, they're pretty slow moving. They've been here a while, but they, they've not managed to go that far. <laughs> or maybe they don't have any motivation to go that far. I mean, they may have to go to the bathroom, but then again, just go in the suit. <laughs> also, I should add, while we're testing this to open, like, I'm excited to get my first ride in the park, but even though it's a normal ride, it can only hold eight people and it takes ages to go all the way around so I'm hoping a massive queue will form for this and if you want to leave to use the bathroom it's even further from the entrance because there's no direct path <laughs> you have to go all the way around so I hope you don't feel sick after this ride I wish I could just make them go on it because that music is also psychological trauma yes I know I've lost 13,000 this month <laughs> turns out free bathrooms aren't that great uh, at making profit <laughs> all right replace that with a normal track why would you even want a loop-de-loop -loop anyway that's just scary. Oh my god, it's stuck again. <laughs> Who designed this? <laughs> if I had it my way, it would just be a straight track the entire way. It's just flat along the ground and you can never leave. Oh, sorry. <laughs> that probably just cost us a lot of money. I forgot to end the testing while I'm, you know, building the coaster. <laughs> Another one's on the way. Hold on, I'll just snap this in. Okay, you're good to go. <laughs> there we go. And home to safety. See, who needs loops? You need just a nice flat track. <laughs> Many guests are thirsty. Okay, that is the one complaint you can't have. <laughs> there is literally smoothies and drinks at the entrance. That is all we have right now. Unless you're physically blocked by the cows, which is a possibility. But just milk them. Okay, the right Rides open, folks. Now you can get drinks and you can go on a roller coaster. What more could you want? I want to entice as many people to ride on, on this as I can because I want the queue to form. So I will make it free. <laughs> Potential monthly income. Nothing. <laughs> many guests need the toilet. <laughs> they need benches. God, they're very needy, aren't they? A lot of people are flooding in now that we have a single ride, though. Although that's just creating more of a traffic jam. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> okay, the cows are moving along. They're being hurt towards the stairs. Do they need the bathroom? I am so impressed by your ability to jump up those stairs. Oh, it's like the wild, wild west herding the cows. <laughs> There's just an enormous line that keeps going. There's a split off now. All the cows went to the bathroom and all the people went to the ride. Oh my god, there's so many people. <laughs> Guys, we actually cannot keep up with this uh, demand. Wait, the milkshake place is out of supplies. Have you seen how many cows we have? Okay, here's the queue. Okay, now, eight at a time, please. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my god, this is gonna take hours. Days even. <laughs> Where are the cows gone? I want to check in with them. Are they queuing for the bathroom? Oh, they're not there. Where are they? Oh, there they are. <laughs> they're still migrating. <laughs> Wait, they've given up bouncing. They're all depressed. <laughs> when even the cows are depressed, you know things are going badly. I'm just curious if they're trying to go to the staff room or the bathroom. Because <laughs> there's a long queue now. It looks like some abstract art or something. It, I don't know. This should be like an ad for veganism. <laughs> Wait, we had four thefts? What could you steal? <laughs> there's literally nothing here. Cosmic Cow 82 <laughs> Entertainer is unhappy. As well as Cosmic Cow 88. You're almost there. We we'll finally found out where you're going. Staff room. Okay. Guys, I hate to break it to you, but if you're all going to the staff room, I don't think you're all going to fit. Wait, only three of them can fit in there? <laughs> They all turned around after all that. It took them like a literal in-game day to get out of here. And now they have to turn around. Let's check in on our queue. How's it going so far? How's our one successful ride going? It's pretty good, actually. I think a lot of the people gave up on the line. So we're going to have to entice more people to the park. All right, this is a steam-powered ride. I just want to do my part in polluting the environment. <laughs> so I'll get that set up for you now, folks. One ride equals seven. 73,000 gallon of oil. Oh, a few of the cosmic cows are quitting, which is just pathetic, honestly. What, you can't handle five days without a break or bathroom in a cow suit bouncing around? Time to pull yourself up by your moo straps <laughs> and really do some hard work. This ride is open. Far less issues here. I love steam. Steam is the way forward for us as an energy source. Oh, wait, this is popular. Hold on, I can make some money here. Quick, while they're already on it, raise the price. <laughs> Each ride, 1800 USD. <laughs> you understand how much damage this ride make to environment? We need to make money back. I don't know why I have that accent. That's just the employee of the Steam ride, okay? He kind of has his own thing. That's his own little franchise that he runs. Why would this wrong? Why you not like Steam? <laughs> Please, <laughs> buy a ticket for Steam. All right, a lot of the cows are marching home. But you know what? In this economy, lots of cows want a job. <laughs> I don't know why my voice keeps changing. Look at these people. Happy to have a job. Yeah, that's right. Keep going. These people are happy to bounce on their others for money. You go home with your dignity. And by the way, return the outfit. <laughs> that's not yours, you know. That belongs to the... The company. It might be good to have like some attractions as well actually. Like not just stuff you can ride on. My first attraction is the cow enclosure. <laughs> I made it so they can't leave this little island I'm making for them. Good luck quitting now. This is great. Now you get a theme park and a zoo all in one go. <laughs> God that is terrifying. Like even from afar it's actually worse for some reason. How come whenever I play these types of games there is just red exclamation marks at all times. <laughs> My screen has permanently got red exclamation exclamation marks up the top. I just realized this ride is broken, so now these people are trapped here for all eternity, just like the cows. <laughs> well, sorry about that, folks. <laughs> it's a hell of a way to go. <laughs> this person's just panicking, like, oh, I don't know how to do this. I've not been trained how to do this. Do you think some of those cows might be like engineers? The economy is tough. Maybe they had to retrain. <laughs> I was an engineer, but now I'm a cow that bounces around on my others all day. <laughs> oh, I can edit the terrain. <laughs> I put the Western Saloon into like a cliff. A few moments later later. <laughs> These poor cows. <laughs> They're just stuck there forever now. Sorry, cows. Sinkhole. That's just the way it goes sometimes. <laughs> oh my god. That is terrifying. I'm just gonna leave that there. Sinkhole, I think. I was gonna put water in, but it actually looks way worse. And even the path is just gonna collapse into it at this rate. Cosmic Cow 71 is thinking about quitting. Well, I hope you're not on the island. This could be a reality show or something. I think it'd be nice to have a ride near here. <laughs> just so, you know, you can get a good view of the cow island. For some reason, Steam is not really taking off. <laughs> some people just don't want to pay 1800 USD <laughs> to ride on the Steam engine, <laughs> yet we still have it going around for no reason. Okay, that is fast. If I can just edit that so that it just gets a full-on strike on the cows, <laughs> I would be pretty happy. <laughs> 
was so close. Oh, that was terrifying. Okay, now the cows have roller coasters forever scraping across them. Oh, pits on fire. <laughs> These things happen, especially when you have like hundreds of fireworks going off every now and again at the same time next to a lot of flammable cows. You know, I think this is a pretty good pack and it's just improving by the second because I keep placing more and more cows. I think psychological damage is the main damage here. Like, fair enough, some people may die. <laughs> A lot of cows especially, but I think the lasting psychological damage is the main damage I've done here, and it it's honestly cruel. But I think we've done enough damage for one day, I say as I continue to add more and more cows. <laughs> you can never have enough cows, but I, I think we will end it there. Alright folks, we're gonna leave it there. I hope I did you proud. I think there's a lot of psychological trauma there. <laughs> Hopefully that bodes well for me, but we are gonna end the video there Thank you so much to frontier for sponsoring the video again There's a link in the description if you want to check out planet coaster console edition for yourself It's available to buy now on Xbox series X slash s Xbox one and ps4 and it'll release on ps5 alongside the launch of the console from November 12th 2020 and thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it if you like my stuff I post every single day and uh, yeah, thanks very much for watching Appreciate it and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now